Today marks the end, as well, of the three-day national period of mourning. Egypt's president is promising merciless and brutal revenge as police try and hunt down the estimated 30 terrorists who took part in Friday's attack. Dozens of people still recovering right now in the hospital. The death toll stands at 305. The terrorists arrived in five off-road vehicles and surrounded the al Rauda Mosque in the North Sinai Desert after two bomb blasts. Most of the gunmen stormed into the mosque, waving ISIS flags, slaughtering innocent worshippers, and the rest of the gunmen waited outside in ambush positions to open fire on the worshippers as they left the building.